Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and today I'm gonna do something exciting which is I love and um, nothing really new, just a haul video and um, I've been like waiting for so long that I will have this chance but I'm so busy this past couple of weeks that I don't even get the chance to do this haul video from Ulta. This is from Ulta. So um, I have a couple of other stores but I think I'm just gonna have to divide this by the stores because it's it's a collective haul. So um, don't judge me. There's so many nice products right now that's the holidays coming and so many ideas and I actually do this for you. Mm -hmm. I want to try to convince you that I'm doing this for you. Yes, I'm going to continue believing on that. Um, just so you guys would know which one is good, which one is not for gift giving and all that stuff for this holiday season that is coming. So I'm going to get started and stop yapping just so we won't stay on YouTube for 10 years, okay? So I'm going to get started. Okay, here is my bag of Ulta. I think it started by. I know everybody um, has this and it quite... It took me a while to jump on the wagon of getting this um, Stardust um, palette by Vegas Ney. But after all the reviews that I've been hearing, I just couldn't wait and I just didn't have time to go to Ulta to grab this. So only if I find out how to open this. Okay. All right. I, I think I have to take off the whole thing. It comes in this box. And then the box itself still has... Oh, 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 okay. It has to lift to open here. Wow, this is so complicated. Okay, the first part, the, this flap, it comes with a... Okay, all right. So with the first flap, it comes in this way. Why is this so complicated? Oh, crap. Okay. It comes with a Too Faced um, primer, the Shadow Insurance, the Better Than Sex, and the Too Faced um, Glamour Dust Glitter Pigment. Hey, that's good. I love pigments. And then on the other side comes the palette. If I do this a little bit faster, Maybe we're not going to last 20 million years here. And the palette is th this. So if I open it, I've been getting a lot of good reviews about this because the colors are beautiful. I'm sure you probably have seen this from other um, YouTubers that are like so um, happy about all this um, colors, especially the showgirl. This is the showgirl. Oh my god, this is really pretty. No, Too Faced by, uh, you know, simple. Too Faced, um, Too Faced is actually, um, a very nice, um, eyeshadow. They're very creamy and very pigmented. So, just by that, um, it's from Too Faced. It's already, like, a, a good, good. Good, good. So, let's check the, let me see the, the strip. I have to swatch a little harder. The pink pearl. This is pink pearl. The strip and the showgirl. Showgirl is very famous. I've heard a lot of um, YouTubers that that's their favorite color from that palette. So I'm excited to try this. I'm probably going to try this to buy tomorrow. Like immediately. So I'm going to keep it out as much as the packaging. Sometimes the packaging is so nice. Even if I want to keep it, I don't have enough space to store it. So Stardust, Stardust Vegas Ney, get ready for me. I'm going to use you tomorrow. Hopefully I'll be able to make a, a video about this. So okay. I am going to... Oh. Oh, oh, you know what? I totally forgot. I, I, good thing I did not throw this away. I love I, I love Too Faced because they always have this um, um, instructions, the guide for every different look. And knowing Vegas, uh, knowing Vegas Ney is really very good with all this. She, she's an amazing, um, 
she's actually an amazing um makeup artist so you know she created all these looks and i'm really excited to um recreate them yes they're pretty nice anyway so i'm gonna keep that over there and then i'm gonna toss this away so the next thing i'm just gonna dig into this bag and see you know which one i'm gonna talk about the next thing that i got was like this um opi collection i love this so much i don't know how many times i have to say this um i love the bambinos because i really don't need the big bottle of um um nail lacquer or nail polish i find this really really very nice because you know sometimes the color it's i know the color would be nice but you know how many times are you are you going to use that color now unless if i open my own nail salon that would really work perfectly for me it's like uh what would i be needing but if i'm just doing this for my personal use i mean this is a perfect size and i love the colors this is kind of like my favorite and who influenced me with this when i saw kathleen lights um haul this and when i saw it in old time like oh, kathleen lights like it so i'm gonna like it too and i like it too and you know to be honest i really like it not just because she like it okay so my next one is the biore biore free your pores i have been loving this i've been using this for quite a while now i don't do it all the time like every two months Mm, because I really don't have that much sometimes it depends on the weather or or the you know or, or the season um, if I go out a lot you know I get so dusty yes you know I would I feel like I have to do it like once a month but if I if it's not really you will really notice if the blackheads are getting more and more then I use it right away and it's really nice and effective for me you know it works really well so I just had fun when I saw this and this is the, the Hello Kitty spongy for a shower. I just love um, sponging myself. And it's the best because it's Hello Kitty. I'm not a crazy Hello Kitty collector. But every time I see them, you know, it's there. And I'm like, okay, let me try that. Box. Okay, the next one that I got is this Grow Gorgeous Serum. It's a hair growth serum. It's not like I, I I need more. It's not like I need more um, volume because I think I had enough. But I, I got this actually um just so you know my hair would grow healthy because it it doesn't mean that you know it's to make to to give you volume. It it just means that you know it'll give more um it'll make your hair more healthy in a way that you know sometimes our hair with all the heat it becomes really brittle. So if you're using something like this to care for your hair, it's really very important. Sometimes we forget that part. And it comes like in this bottle. And the bottle is, um, I forgot. The bottle is two fluid ounces and it comes with a dropper. So I'm sh pretty sure that, you know, it comes with a dropper. If I get this out, this one, and it's pretty simple. You know, um, I should not throw that away because it has its instructions so so that one you know and the next thing that i thought is this daily cleansing pad. this daily cleansing pads from avino i really like this and specifically this product um it just is really very gentle in my face you know um, i do have my makeup remover the wipes but you know once in a while i use this um daily cleansing pads when I, I feel like, you know, it just depends on the situation. There are times that you're really in the mood to like scrub your face, wipe your face and everything. Cause even if I use a makeup remover, I would still um clean up my face first, you know? And so I kind of do it alternately. I just don't want my face to get used to one thing all the time. I don't know. I just, I just feel like, you know, it's more effective for me. Uh, of changing products once in a while S same with my hair every time i use the shampoo or conditioner the whole time it just doesn't work as good as it's supposed to be so the next thing i got is the purology um this is damn expensive i did got the hydrate shampooing shampooing and for conditioner and i believe they're like 
I'm not exactly sure though. Um, but uh, the lady in um, Ulta explained to me all the details about the caring for the hair and all that stuff. At some point at that day, I was all about caring for my hair. You know, I have this like kind of like episode. I'm not exactly sure if a lot of girls go through the same thing that at one point everybody's so obsessed of how to make their teeth white or how to care for their hair or what kind of best bronzer that they're looking for whatever but at some point you know a lot of us gets to kind of like um obsessing about something so um i am willing to try this even though it's really expensive but you know anything for my hair and it look better uh why not i'm just trying it i'm not saying that i'll stick with that forever so anyway um i also got i got two because i think it's buy one get one half off so why not I, I love Ulta so much because they have a lot of deals. Plus, I get coupons, I get points, and it can be deducted. You know, um, I get points, and then um, for being like uh, an Ulta shopper, and those points you can use it even if I buy my high-end products sometimes, and I get discounts. And I get to save all those points. That's why I've been going back. You know, if there are products that is in Ulta. Even if they have it in Sephora, I run to Ulta. It's not, you know, I love Sephora, but I also love Ulta. So, and the next thing is my It Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores Pressed Powder. I've been hearing a lot of good stuff about this, and I am like, I gotta try that because I love to try new stuff, and anything that would cover my pores and would make me look flawless, I'm up for it. And so far, I have heard nothing but great reviews about this. My baby's actually watching me right now and she's la he's laughing. Like I'm a little crazy up here. Talking to a video. But it's very, very fine though. It looks like this, just plain. But oh my god, it's just really, really good. And it comes in 0.31 ounces. So... It's not a lot, but I'm sure it goes a long way. But anything that would make it, everything look better, all girls would go for it. I'm sure about that. Yeah. And the next thing that I got is a curl defining um, hair cream. Um, I do have curly hair and I iron my hair at all times. For a lot of you probably already know, uh, it's pretty obvious. I still have like some of my curl stuff. I don't know, um, I've been kind of like slacking lately of how I iron my hair and sometimes there's like a leftover curl on top which is really annoying because oh my god I have to redo it. So um, sometimes I kind of want to get my, just leave my hair um, curly and my husband loves my hair curly so um, I just want to get rid of that insecurity of having uh, curly hair and that's why I bought this Not Your Mother's Pinky Mousse Curl Defining Hair Cream. And the lady in um, sorry, the lady in Ulta was explaining to me that this is really good and kind of like put it on on my curls after I take a shower and it will it would like really define my curls really beautiful and it won't make me feel so insecure about my kink hair cuz my hair get tends to be so kinky you don't even want to see. So and this one is an intense hair unit renewal treatment. And um, this Nourish Moisturize and Tame Freeze. This is also a product from Not Your Mother's. Not Your Mother's. <laughs> and this one. So um, yeah, it does have uh, a direction here because I'm not really used of all these products. But definitely I'm willing to try as long as I, you know, I come up with a beautiful set for my, for my curls, you know, because I really want to kind of want to embrace it you know a lot of people keeps on telling me oh my god I wish I have your curls I'm like oh yeah go ahead and grab it we can like exchange and like probably transplant it to your head <laughs> go ahead so also I've been using the macadamia um hair mask and I haven't tried their um what is this shampoo so um there was like this um travel size and I thought you know what I want to try it 
I'm just trying to cover the price. Oh, okay. Well, I don't have to be. Um, I saw this in like the clearance area of Ulta and it was sold for $4.97, which is very easy for me to try this and it's not so expensive. Um, I've been hearing a lot of good stuff about this. Actually, not so much, but since it's from the, the same company from my hair mask, because I always use the macadamia and I don't buy that in um, Ulta. I'm sorry, but I don't buy that in Ulta because it's so darn expensive. So I buy it in Marshalls. They're like half the price. I I bought my like um, the medium size tub. I, I, I buy it in um, Marshalls for $19 and the biggest one is for $26. Because if I buy it in Ulta, it's like $50 for that small tub. So I take advantage. Anyway, it, it, it would last for a while like because I don't put hair mask every week. I probably put hair mask like every two weeks or three, you know, because I like what I said, I kind of change all my regimen for my hair all the time. Just like for my makeup too. And the next thing that I got was this, um, this kind of like loofah and there's like this, um, thing around it. It feels so, this feels so good in your body. I feel very, very clean every time I use this one. I, I know sometimes when it's like brand new, it kind of feels rough on your skin, but after a while, after like you've been using it for a couple of times, it kind of feels nice. Right now it's just, it's really rough. So when you wet it, it becomes like really, really soft. So I got to get started of trying to wet that. And so, so the next thing that I got was um, this NYX HD finishing powder. Um, this is kind of like the banana powder. And I love using this on my under eye. Every time after I um, put on my concealer, it's... It's, it's a must-have because I have the tendency of like um, my concealer would like go away so it has to, I have to have what I have to put this on after I put on my concealer it's very important and it's really good this is kind of like my second um my second uh, yeah that <laughs> anyway why am I lost of words ever did everybody have experience that like you know what it is, but for some reason, you just don't know right now when you have to say it. You just don't know. And um, I also bought the sample size for the Clinique for Man. This is the charcoal face wash. Um, <clears throat> well, I wanted my husband to try it since with his job, you know, he's very exposed with, you know, dust and all that stuff. Um, he always complains about, you know, he wants his face really clean. So, um... I just purchased this uh, and see if she, he likes it because, you know, I don't buy the big container right away because he tends to, like, if he doesn't like it, he will never, ever use it. He, he's that picky. So I start with a little one, and if he likes it, then I'm going to purchase the bigger one. Of course, he has to pay for it. Times, you know, he has to shop for me also. <laughs> and okay, so the next thing that I got, you know, oh, this one. The next thing that I got was um, I wanted to try the brand Essence. So I went ahead and purchased a mascara from Essence. Uh, it's called the Get Big Lashes. And, you know, um, I've heard a lot of good stuff about Essence. And in my, locals, uh, in my local Ulta, they really don't carry so much products from Essence. You, you guys got to step it up, you know? I mean, Essence, they're very affordable. And they have, like, one tiny corner in that um, Ulta that I go to. I wish they can, like, make it bigger since, you know, it's very affordable. It's really, really good prices. And, you know, I've heard that it's a very great product. So why not, you know? I'm going to definitely try this one. And then I also bought two, um, is this two? Yeah, three lip liner. And the first one that I got was, um, does it even have a name? Honey Berry. Mm, nice. And the next one is Cute Pink. pretty nice and I got the this one and the name of this is 
Wish Me a Rose. So they're really beautiful um, lip liners that I will be able to use, and they're very affordable. I love them. I, mean, I don't think I'll. I don't think I have to spend, you know, lip liners from my high ends. Like you know, I know they're really probably very nice, but it's a lip liner. I don't think I have to spend that much. The only expensive lip liner that I have is only one, and that is my Mac. Staunchly stylish. What I got was uh, products from NYX. Was this all from NYX? Yes, these are all from NYX. I do got, like, I'm obsessed with their soft matte lip cream that I got the Sun Paolo and I got the Milan. I believe I, I had Milan and I, I think I finished it. Hmm. Finally, something finished, but yeah, I had to get them because they're like my go-to lipsticks you know it it never fails all the time like there are some lipsticks actually the one that I'm wearing right now is Marc Jacobs those like the ones that they give away the small lipstick they kind of like a little seriously you're expensive why are you doing this to me okay anyway the next thing that I got is the Super Skinny Eye Marker from NYX. And I am curious about this. I don't want to make it look like I it is a marker, but let's see. Ooh, well, I like the felt tip of this one. Hmm. Whoa, that looks nice. Well, I'll find out tomorrow. Tomorrow. Hmm. Today is the only time that I was able to do a video since my my daughter decided to be like, okay, mommy. Well, he she actually didn't say that, but she's a little bit more like calm right now. She's very clingy lately, though. I don't know why. It was like I have to be with mommy all the time. That's how it is. Okay, moving on. I got the Revlon um, Blackest Black Liquid Eye Pen. In, um, in black is black um, what am I talking about and uh, it comes because I ran out of my um my favorite and I've been like checking out like what I said um my local Ulta they carry all major brands that they have but damn they gotta stack up um they have the Kardashian and the only thing that I like over there is their eyeliner and they don't have it they don't have it it's so sad this is the Revlon Oh, hmm, that's nice. The second one. Well, we'll find out, you know. Sometimes, you know, they may look like nice while you swatch them, but when you put them on, like, it's seriously very hard. But those are the stuff that I got from Ulta. And I have more. I actually have more. Cool one. So the next thing that I got from Ulta. Um, I actually got this as a freebie because I actually purchased the Ariana Grande um, Rollerball. It smells so good. I just, I always buy the Rollerball first and if I like it, then maybe I would buy the bigger bottle. But this is a great way. Whoever invented this, I love you. It's a chance for me to try it first before, you know, buying the whole bottle and suddenly hate it and it's just gonna stay there and after 10 years it'll smell horrible so it's really great that that happens and this it comes with the whole thing that lady in Ulta she loves me so much that she gave me this even if she's not supposed to this is kind of like the makeup bag so it's pretty cute it looks like that right I know this video is getting longer and longer but anyway I'm in the mood right now so let's continue so okay, the next thing that I got is, ooh, the next thing that I got is the Lowe's palette. You know what? I was just so in love as soon as I saw this, I gotta have it. Everybody, move over. I gotta have it. It comes in this beautiful pouch, which is adorable, and um, the packaging. It's just amazing it's just this this uh, webby kind of looking thingy they always have like 
a unique style, like a very modern, unique style. And the colors, I'm, and I don't think I would even swatch it right now because they're just too nice. The greens are just, the emerald green are just so beautiful. These are so pretty. You know, and this fastball. Ooh, this is really nice. I know you you can't see, but this is very pretty. I mean, I probably would do some videos of this because I really can't focus on this right now, all of it, just because, you know, I don't have that much time. So I'll probably do it one by one. I'll probably make a tutorial or a makeup look on every palette that I will be getting. I think I'm just going to do that, you know, once in a while. So, okay, so I didn't get much on that haul, but I also got two um, two things from Real Techniques. I do got the, the double, what should I call this, uh, Real Techniques sponge because I love them so much. I know Beauty Blender is really a holy grail, but this one too. I cannot let it go. It's just really beautiful and very affordable. I get two for ten dollars i think in ulta and it comes in this one's already so pss, why not i'd rather get go for that and i also got um, a brush um i like this one the blush brush i've been looking for like a single brush like this for a long time and finally they came up with it and i also jumped on the wagon and i'll definitely go back to to to, to bleh, to ulta and buy more of that nyx liquid suede because this is just the bomb. This is my color. This is me. Can't you see? It says Jackie. I'm just kidding. But I just love this. And I just love the the, the consistency. You know, it's not too thick and it's not too like drying in your mouth. Not your mouth, but in your lips. And so you feel more comfortable rather than feeling like dry. So I like it. I like that a lot because it gets so uncomfortable when there's something like um, dry there. But anyway, so this is all I got. <laughs> this is all I got. Seriously. <laughs> I make it sound like that's it. But anyway, no. Um, well, we have to end anyway. But to end this, this is how, what I have to say. And that's all I got from Ulta. They are a lot. I'm thankful that, you know, I uh, get the chance to have them. And so I hope you guys have seen some of the stuff that you might want to buy also. And if you have any questions with all this product that I showed, if you want any kind of like review on any of them, please let me know. Uh, leave your comments down below and let me know what you want to hear about all this. Because I'm going to start um, using a lot of them already, starting like right now and then i'll let you know and so thank you guys for watching my video and i hope i'll see you guys next time and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give me two thumbs up and i will see you soon bye